Hey, oh, Viking Raven here again with another Rankin video. This time, the Mighty Morbid Angel. Number nine. I don't own this one. There's a reason why. Il Divina Insanos, whatever the fuck it's called. It's no need to even talk about this fucking shit. It's a waste of fucking time. Just fucking awful, awful, awful. Out of the way. Number nine. Kingdoms Disdained. It's a return to the full death metal roots. It's not a bad album. Steve Tucker returns as vocalist. Scotty Fuller's only fucking album. Hopefully it's the hopefully it's a step in the right direction. Favorite song is For No Master. Other songs I don't mind are Piles of Little Arms, uh Garden of Dis Disdain. For No Masters, like I said, declaring new lost secret hell. And the fall of idols. Number seven is I have Domination. I like this album here. It's more experimental. I find it on some fucking elements. The last album of the David Benson. Uh, pardon me. Last album of David Benson. And this also had fucking Eric Routain's first Morbid Angel album also. Favorite song is Hate work. Oh, that song is so fucking creepy and evil. Other songs I do mind are Dominate, I like. Where the Slime Live, which a lot of people don't like, but I like that song a lot. Uh, Dawn of the Angry. Caesar's Palace is fucking amazing also. Okay. Number six. Heretic. To me, this album is fucking underrated. I, I'll admit the Production is pretty bad. Overall, I like a lot of songs on this fucking album. Needs to be given a proper chance. Steve Tucker's last fucking album until Kingdoms. Favorite song is Praise of Strength. Other songs which I don't mind or actually which I like are, are Enshrined by Grace, Beneath a Hollow, Stricken Arise, and God of Our Own Divinity. That's a fucking killer one, man. Number five. Formulas Fatal to the Flesh. I really enjoy this fucking album, man. Steve Tucker's first morbid fucking angel album. I enjoy the old ones lyrics type on this. A fucking amazing album. Favorite song is Prayer of Hatred. That song is fucking amazing. Other songs I do like are Heavenly... No, PB. Heaving Earth, Prayer of Hatred, like I said, Bill Ursog, whatever. Chamber of Dis is fucking awesome, too. Uh, uh, Hell Spawn, The Rebirth. Love that song also, man. Great album, man. Number four. Covenant. Holy shit, man. This album is fucking amazing. It's always in top mention for the favorite Morbid Angel album. And I could see why. To me, it's the last pure classic Morbid Angel from the from the David Vincent era. Favorite song, another fucking creepy song, God of Emptiness. Other songs which I do like are Rapture is fucking amazing. Pain Divine, World of Shit is amazing. Uh, other ones I do mind them. Angel of Disease and Sworn to the Black. Number three. Blessed are the Sick. Amazing album. This album has a perfect fucking floor, flow. Pardon me. My first Morbid Angel album I ever heard and fucking purchased. Trey is insane. Favorite song on Holy Blasphemies. Well, this is also Richard Brunel's last studio album. And that album cover. Just look at that. Holy shit. Other songs I do like are Fall From Grace, Brainstorm. Uh, the title fucking track is amazing. Also, man, holy, The Ancient Ones. Just just a great album, man. Days of, and Day of Suffering. Holy fuck. Number two. Controversial pick. You'll see why. Altars of Madness. It's kind of a shocker here that this is not number one. Many consider this their best and one of death metal's greatest albums ever, which absolutely it fucking is. 
Trey's riffs on this are just holy fuck, man. And the drumming from Pete, holy fuck also, man. Top fucking notch. Favorite song is Chapel of Ghouls. Other songs which I do enjoy are Immortal Rights, Suffocation, Maze of Torment. Holy shit, that song is fucking awesome, man. Bleed for the Devil and Blasphemy. Evil Spells is also great too. Which leads to number one. A lot of controversy, but Gateways to Annihilation. Probably it's a very unpopular choice. I understand why. To me, th this album was something special, man. I can't say enough how much I like this album. Not one bad song, man. As a usual, the riffs and drum work is fucking top notch. Eric Rutten's last studio album with the band. Favorite song is the creepy vocals, man. Holy shit. He Who Sleeps. Steve Tucker's best vocal performance of Morbid Angel is on this fucking album. Other songs I do like are Summoning Redemption, Angel Still I Am. Still I, am. I is an amazing song too, God of the Forsaken, man. At One With Nothing, Opening Up The Gates, Secure Limitations. If you haven't heard it, man, please listen to the song, He Who Sleeps. It is so fucking evil and creepy, man. Well, that's it. Hit the subscribe button, please, and tell me what you think and stay fucking heavy.